Charles publicly admitted he was not faithful to Diana after their marriage became irretrievably broken down in a documentary broadcast in June 1994. But on the night, Diana made sure she was seen out having a good time despite the bombshell confession, according to royal author Andrew Morton. Charles revealed worries over Duke driving before horror crash royal heartbreak, how Charles was devastated after reading letter Diana stunned in the revenge dress as she attended a glitzy event at the Serpentine Gallery. Writing in Diana, in her own words, Mr. Morton said, Diana had decided against seeing an advance viewing of the film, and on the evening of the broadcast, which was watched by 13 million people, she set out not merely to enjoy herself, but to be seen doing so. She had a long-standing engagement at the Serpentine Gallery. The dinner was a sophisticated international event and one where she found herself among friends. Her flirty little black dress designed by Christina Stambolian could not have been a more appropriate choice, its style shouting the message, whatever Charles may do, I'm having a ball. It was immediately dubbed the revenge dresses. Yet in private she was not so calm. Her initial response to the program was, my first concern was for the children. I wanted to protect them. How the Queen's relationship with Charles was disastrous for Diana Royal Row. How Prince William resented Charles and Diana then she added, I was pretty devastated myself. But then I admire the honesty. Tensions between Charles and Diana were running high when the documentary aired in 1994, two years after the couple split. A year later. Diana explosively said there were three of us in her marriage to Charles, in reference to his affair with Camilla. Diana described the marriage as a bit crowded in the 1995 Panorama interview. The couple went on to divorce in 1996 and Diana died in a tragic Paris car crash in 1997. Charles went on to marry Camilla who he first dated in the early 1970s in 2005, 